welcome back everyone to the channel this is game changer x and we are playing more shadow of the colossus this is the 10th colossus did game nice little sand unit tracks are well hidden shaking the earth its gaze is upon thee this gaze why it says its gaze is very important but this colossus is quite far west from the initial this shrine so it will take us quite some time to reach it in our normal uh, video fashion we'll get there in a few cuts first we'll check which direction it is there it is it's quite far away so let's get there across the bridge across the open field towards the left across this field we went towards the right to fight the last colossus here we go we are going more left and then straight ahead into this valley into this canyon and then here into this cave we are here this fight is going to be quite tough and you need the help of aggro because we'll be fighting a worm which will follow us in the sand and just will put its head out and attack us so we we'll need the speed and maneuverability of aggro and before you reach this colossus you need to be very good with uh, how to ride aggro but i had so much trouble you we'll see and also remember in the in the new version of this game you'll have to look at the colossus with keeping l2 pressed so l2 yeah. L2 looks at the Colossus and R1 is what is used to uh, aim the arrow, aim the uh, bow. So keep R1 pressed and it will, the aiming reticle will come. So he, he doesn't attack us by himself, we'll have to actually ride towards him. Now L2, he's just behind us. He'll have to be at full speed because he is quite fast. Shooting his eyes are quite a challenge. And if you go near one of the walls, he will do that. He will try to attack you. And it will actually break this sequence. So here I'm trying to actually go around. But if you... Uh, here I'm next to a wall again. Thank God we avoided that attack. The legs cannot possibly carry thee away from his danger. We know that's why we are riding aggro. He's behind us again. Okay, show me your eyes. Show me your eyes. Oh man, we are again next to a wall. We missed it. Show me your eyes. No. No, no, no. We are next to a wall again. Thank God. We avoided him. Oh, he's faster here and he knocks us down. We didn't have full speed on aggro. Yeah. So if you get knocked down, yeah. you need to get yeah. immediately get up on aggro. But if you're on the ground, he'll kill you in one shot. Aim for it. Ah, yes. Now, now we understand why that gaze word was put at the very beginning. His gaze is upon you. Yeah. It's easier said than done. If we keep on going round, then aim to the, for the eyes are, are much, even more difficult. Here I think we'll be able to hit it. Because we have gone round. Okay, straighten up, straighten up. No. No! He got us! And we are dead. Oh, second try. Show me your eyes, buddy. Show me your eyes. I want to poke it. Okay, we got it. We got it. Here, a mistake was done by me where I hit the speed of aggro high. So I overshot him because there is a small cut in here which will show him, uh, which will show him, uh, you know, getting knocked by that uh, sidewalk. But I overshot him. That's why it took more time to actually get back to him. You cannot lose even a single second because he doesn't stay down for long. And I also didn't have my sword out, which is a mistake I'll keep on doing. Now when I'm, I'm seeing it, I'm like, I could have avoided these mistakes. 
But all this will be for nothing as we'll get knocked down by him in a moment. The first uh, one disappears. And he, you can hear the, you know, the fear in Wander's voice. Agro! Agro, where are you? This guy will eat me alive. Ah, oh, man, there you go. This is our second death to the same Colossus. One of the toughest one, I'd say. Third item. Here, we are like determined to, to defeat it. And we'll do it pretty easily in the end. Straighten up, straighten up. Okay, we got him one. We don't make the same mistake of, uh, you know, immediately going behind him and uh, full speed on aggro. So here we have some time. Where is he? Oh, there he is. There he is. Go full speed and jump on him directly. We still didn't get our sword out, which we could have done on the horse itself very easily. Here we are attempting to, to reach the, the top room, which is on top of his head. But you can see how, how Wanda struggles even to go on a surface which is just moving a little bit. Okay, here it is. Three strikes. We are in a panic mode already. Okay, good hit, good hit. Good one, one more. Get a foothold, get a foothold, Wanda. Get a foothold. Okay, three, three full hits. This one disappears and immediately. Arrow! Okay, here we go for the second. So you'll have to do that twice. You'll have to hit his highs twice, which makes it even more challenging. He's coming. One full steam. Show me your eyes. Okay, here we go. Same thing, you have to move away and then come around. Not too fast, otherwise you'll overshoot him. Again, we make the mistake of not okay. We got our sword out. So, three more strikes. Good one. Good one. We are sorry, buddy. Alright. With that, Dirge is down. Number 10, Colossus. Mystery in the sand. We get a new trophy. Hopefully you guys like this short and sweet Colossus hunting videos. If you did like it, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you're new here. And I'll see you with the next Colossus. Six more to go. Game changer X.